What is going on you guys? The Spanking Guru back and uh haven't done one of these in a while, so uh thought I'd just try to get one done. <laughs> just thought of a random topic and uh decided to move with it. Don't know how long I'm gonna be talking for, so if this game is cut down, sorry about that, I can't talk about it because that's my first intention. Uh, but you will be seeing the great spawn of me <laughs> and how I spawn in. Seems like they're just like, yeah, we can put him right there. <laughs> but, uh, alright. As you can tell by the title, I have a serious question. And, uh, I like, uh, I like when I do commentaries like this because I, I enjoy seeing feedback from you guys. So, you know, listen to everything. And, uh, if you can give me some feedback on, like, a decision or something like that, hit me up. If you look at all my videos, man, I reply to most of my comments. If they're not dumb, I'll reply to your comments, trust me. But, uh, alright, PC Gaming. Uh, this has kind of been a, uh, a very funny subject for me because it, it seems like all roads were leading to this. Uh, I don't know if I'm done with console gaming, I'm not too sure, but what I basically did is I basically drew out and I wrote down, yes, I have on a piece of paper, I do end up having a uh, a list right in front of me <laughs> I have a list right in front of me and what it is is it is currently a list of reasons on why I should and why I shouldn't get PC gaming so again if you guys have any questions or anything like that let me know this is some into some console gameplay maybe some of the last but I'll get into it later so basically, uh, for those of you guys that were on, that are in elementary and high school and even college, I don't think there's any other, but uh, what ended up happening was, we ended up having a, a Christmas break, and I ended up working holiday hours, and what basically happened was, is I made a little bit of money, and uh, my thinking was that this money is going to be going towards, uh, you know, a gaming PC. You know, that was my whole thought behind it. That's why I worked so hard during the Christmas break. And, uh, so yeah, that's basically why I did it. And that's why I wasn't able to post too many videos. It's just because I got home after a long day of work and, man, I was tired. I was just like, no, nope, not doing a commentary today. <laughs> and I just kept putting it off. But, uh, you know, I found some inspiration and stuff like that. And, you know what, I'm really happy that I'm doing a commentary today. I always enjoy the feedback I get from you guys. But, um, alright. And, uh, one thing that immediately scares me is the simple fact that I'm not going to be the one buying it. Uh, this guy I go to college with, he's going to be buying or showing me the proper products to get, you know, for, you know, worth my money, you know, and stuff like that. He's the gaming expert for PCs. That's not me. i complete noob on this. And that's really what scares me is the whole putting it together... You know, I have no idea what's going on, so, like, PC talk is just, like, a different language when when they ever talk about, like, motherboards and shit like that. I just immediately tune out because I have no idea what they're talking about. But again, it's just a learning curve. Uh, it's maybe, it's a little bit intimidating knowing that I have going to be buying something, and I have no idea whatsoever how to put it together, but... If I put it wrong, the wrong way, the wrong way, it won't work and stuff like that. Just scary things like that. And plus, I'm not the most delicate person. Like, I have broken stuff out of rage and uh, like try my patience. PC gaming, you're gonna see what happens. <laughs> uh, one thing that definitely is a positive. I'm just gonna go through some of the positives and negatives. I just had to take a quick break just to see what's next on my list. And that is the revival of a certain Call of Duty game. And no, it's not uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. That game's kind of over. <laughs> One game I am currently talking about is Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. What basically is going to be happening is that console on the console, that game is absolutely dead. You know, it's full of hackers. I, I can still get into games, but... It's never fun just to see hackers into the game, and uh, I'm assuming that COD 4 PC is still alive because there's not too many complaints from it. Uh, if I get a good enough PC, I'll run it because can you believe that that game is f like four or five years old? That's just incredible, and uh, 
I'll be able to play it and uh, you know simple as that and I'll be knowing everything about it <laughs> and uh, COD 4 is a great game but it's not only the Call of Duties uh, PC gaming is supposed to expand my horizons in uh, regards to gaming that I couldn't do before uh, some games that jump off the top right here three are Monday Night Combat uh, 64 uh, servers players of Battlefield 3 and Bad Company 2 uh, it was unfortunate that I wasn't able to get the games during the uh, the Christmas sale I uh, I really tried to get them but uh, my friend he and the, the friend who's actually building the PC for me his uh, dad ended up hurting himself and they had to go to the hospital and he said it was just tough and I, I told him don't worry about it I mean I don't want to look like the douche that was like no make me a PC game so yeah uh, one definite thing that I think is very very cool to me especially when it comes to single player games is Pirate Bay now for those of you guys that do not know that use Pirate Bay for music is I did a little research on you know what gaming can do when you are on Pirate Bay and I ended up I ended up you know typing in some games to see if I was able to get them and lo and behold there's great games on there that are just so tempting when they're single player <laughs> uh, another game uh, that's free to play is Team Fortress 2 that's just like one specific game that I think is great uh, for PC gaming so that's why uh, let's see what else we got here so Pirate Bay we found I found like great single-player games like Skyrim uh, Portal 2 Limbo you know Dead Space 1 and 2 I'm just really shocked at how good of a value it is to get something off there and that's why and yeah that's it, it's just incredible like that and it's only single-player I mean what it's end up going to happening is if it's multiplayer like for example for Battlefield 3 I found out you have to buy it on Origin which is like basically like the Pepsi to the cola for Steam and uh, what's basically going to be happening is I'm going to have to start up a, an account there and stuff like that just because Battlefield 3 on the PC is one of the reasons why I'm going to be getting that game alright some uh, positives and negatives now let's keep it going uh, one definite thing is knowing only like one person that definitely PC games that I'm gonna be talking to when it, it was a big selling point to me to know that all my friends had Xboxes because what usually happens is it would be really awkward and there's nobody to talk to and stuff like that but with like the friends that I had like I could bounce ideas off of them we joked around you know we had everything to talk about we could talk about what happened in high school you know stuff like that that was that was a great part of it uh... <laughs> one definite thing that i think is maybe not overrated but might be a little bit troubling is graphics and uh... so with the eight hundred to a thousand dollar pc i'm guessing that's not going to get me the top end but it's going to get me a, a pretty good pc and uh, one definite thing I am worried, ab not worried about, but excited for maybe a little bit is, you know, the upgrade in, you know, graphics. But then again, I remember switching to from standard definition to H def HD def, high def, high definition, sorry, couldn't speak there. But yeah, uh, I remember s switching it up right there and uh you know what it, I don't really notice a difference now when it comes to HD so that's why I think graphics are maybe a little bit overrated and finally the last thing is obviously going to be the cost uh, I don't want to spend you know all my money on PC gaming it's gonna be uh, very interesting so uh, leave a comment you guys the game's over right now I, I guess I talked through all of it but uh, leave a comment you know on your opinion and stuff like that Thanks for guys for uh, listening to the commentary. I ended up going 15 and 2. Just ended up wrecking shop. So yeah, I'll check you guys later. Peace.